this has been a really interesting journey for all of us that's involved in it. And it, it really came out of uh, what was really a fundamental discovery in our laboratory about an enzyme that carried out what we thought was a really interesting reaction. Why we were so super interested in that is because that's a step that's really difficult to do in the organic synthesis laboratory. You require multiple steps, many reagents, you have to use air and moisture sensitive reagents to do that and the yields are, are not very good at many of those steps. So here we'd found an enzyme that could do it in a single step under really great conditions for us. The lab to market program really started coming into focus when we were discussing about a year ago, the potential commercial applications of this enzyme, how to immobilize it, where that would go. And that's when we really became to, to look at the lab to market program as a vehicle for all of us to be able to understand just how to take that fundamental discovery in our academic lab and put it somewhere on a store shelf. My first experience was working with Dr. Sorensen in 2021 in, in an academic research lab where I was able to dip my toes into research and learn how to perform research and it helped develop my curiosity about also the applications of the foundational research that we did in the lab. Dr. Sorensen and I had conversations and I had really taken a keen interest into commercialization, into our potential research products. I learned about the Lab to Market program actually through the community that we have here at the Faculty of Science. I participated in the 3K Spark competition last year with Prairie iGEM and I was approached by Daniel Heschuk who is a program development specialist at the Science Innovation Hub where he mentioned the Lab to Market program. So over the past fall we decided to look into this application, we went through the interview process and did the grant application and we successfully got in. The part that I'm most excited about is the idea of taking something we've worked on in the academic lab and moving it outside. Ultimately the goal would be to develop potentially a biotechnology company that's based around this work. So to work with somebody like Randy who's excited about trying to take this on and push this forward as a technology, for me that's the part that I'm really excited about. I'm really excited about learning new things. This program is quite out of my comfort zone. So developing that skill set, being able to interview that many people and managing all of that I think is very exciting. But also the knowledge I'm going to learn about that, learning about my market and seeing if this product will be able to fit. Like John said, I'm very excited to see where this project will go and see if we can commercialize this project with our wonderful team. As this fits in with my long-term goals, I would love to be a part of the biotech industry, drive it forward, and maybe one day be CEO of a biotech company. With being one of the few undergraduates in the Lab to Market Validate program, I'm very excited to showcase that undergraduates. I'd like to inspire other undergrads to explore less traditional career paths, to get involved with the biotech industry and learn that there is a place for entrepreneurship in science. Well, one of the things I do want to say about being part of this lab to market program is that this is the national lab to market program and there's groups involved in this right across the country. So it's a really unique opportunity for us to, you know, showcase the opportunities for undergraduate students to get involved in research, for undergraduate students to think a little bit about commercializing and, and, and going out, for, out from what they learn in the lab at the university and taking it beyond. So for us, that's a really exciting opportunity to participate in this program. And for me, it's been great to work with somebody that's that enthusiastic and that engaged on this kind of commercialization, this kind of non-traditional career path. I think it's an excellent opportunity. Dr. Sorensen and I have been working with each other for over three years and he's been a great mentor in my life has helped me realize my potential and has pushed me to explore my career interests, not just within the academic research lab, but beyond. My experiences with the Sorensen Lab has given me the confidence to apply to the Masters of Bioengineering at UC Berkeley, where I recently got accepted. I'm very excited to be a proud UM alumni and to pursue my entrepreneurship and commercialization interests in the biotech industry down in California. My advice to other undergraduates is to get involved and to not limit yourself. Open every single door that you can and develop your community. Getting involved with our student clubs on campus, getting involved in research, meeting with different professors across the university, finding mentorship, these are all 
amazing opportunities that open many doors for yourself. You'll never know where life might take you.